Hello Gemini, welcome to another love reading. This is going to be a you and them love reading. We're gonna be looking at your energies, your person's energies, what's going on between you and the potential outcome. It's a general reading. So as always, it will not resonate with every Gemini watching. Take what resonates, leave the rest. Feel free to check out my playlist for Gemini if this doesn't resonate at all. And we're gonna just jump right into it. We'll start looking at what's going on in your connection at this time all right spirits angels guides what messages do you have for gemini when it comes to love what messages do you have for gemini this will be for those of you who have someone in mind all right that's good what's going on for gemini's in love at this time spirit what's going on for gemini Wow, starting right away with reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. This is a common theme for Gemini's, at least in the last couple of readings I've done for you. Let's see, anything else? What's going on for Gemini's and love? So for a lot of you are dealing with someone from your past, this could also be a past life connection. Healing family issues, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So this for me as a reader, I don't always think about parents. I think about like there's possibly some sort of family situation uh, either that you have or that your person has that's affecting this connection. So let's get some more information. Tell me more about this connection between Gemini and this other person's spirit. Tell me more about this connection. Well, that was fast. Six of Cups reverse came out. Tell me more about this connection between Gemini and this other person. Ace of Wands reverse. So I feel like something didn't really take off for you guys. Someone's still stuck in the past with the Six of Cups reverse and the Six of Pentacles reverse. So someone wasn't able to give to this connection or perhaps they weren't able to give you what you deserved, Gemini. Bottom of the deck, I have the lovers. So that's you showing up in your own reading here. Very interesting. So let's see. Let's learn more. Tell me more. Why is the Six of Cups reverse? Gemini. Six of Cups reverse. The Hermit. Virgo energy here with the Hermit. Some of you could be dealing with a Virgo. But I feel like this is someone that's really thinking of the past. Tell me more about the Six of Cups reverse. Someone's trying to figure out, seek answers regarding the past. Which makes sense if there's reconciliation and there's the eight of pentacles so yeah they're thinking about something regarding effort or work that's related to the past so maybe like there's work that needs to be done here focus someone's focus someone's putting an effort to figure something out here to get some sort of answer why is the ace of wands reverse Wow. Yeah, you see what I'm seeing? I have the two of cups here with the three of pentacles reversed. So I feel like there was something else that got in the way here of your connection. And I feel like that's why something wasn't able to fully get started or wasn't able to complete or something like that. Can I get one more? For this ace of wands reverse. Get one more please. Four of Cups reverse. So someone possibly, if whatever they weren't interested in, they've had a change of heart. Someone has had a change of heart and I feel like they're thinking about returning to you, Gemini. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles reverse. 
Why is the Six of Pentacles reverse? <laughs> the Ace of Cups. Very nice, Gemini. The Ace of Cups. New love. Abundance. And Queen of Cups. Yeah. This person has a lot of love for you. There's a lot of emotions here. I feel like it's mutual. Even though they weren't able to give you in the past, they weren't able to give you what you deserved or there was an imbalance here. Um, I feel like there's still love. Again, a running theme here with Gemini's lately, at least on my last couple of readings. So if this is resonating for you, Gemini. Let, let, leave me a comment. Let me know if it's resonating. But also um, check out my other Gemini readings because those might resonate for you as well. Can I get one more for this Six of Pentacles reverse? Yeah, Nine of Pentacles. I feel like um, this is how they view you, Gemini, like this Nine of Pentacles. They have a lot of um, appreciation for you. They, they, they are attracted to you. So how are they, what are you, how do you feel about each other? Spirits, angels, guides. Messages for Gemini, please. Regarding their person. Let's see. Let's start with you, Gemini. Tell me how Gemini is thinking or feeling about this person at this time. How's Gemini thinking or feeling about this person at this time? Well, Gemini, I feel like some of you possibly are keeping this close to the vest. Maybe you haven't um, admitted to anybody or even yourself that you still love this person or your feelings run deep how is this person feeling or thinking about gemini at this time what are they thinking or feeling about gemini lamb so they have something to tell you i feel like there's there's something unspoken between you here Get some more energies i'm using my um energy oracle deck this is available in my shop if you'd like it's a deck that you can print at home i printed mine now at staples spirits angels guides messages for gemini just want to get some more idea of the energies between you tell me about gemini's energies at this time these two wanted to come out past life and falling apart. So there was a tower moment here with an ex. You have had a connection with this person in the past. So I feel like th this is someone that you had a tower moment with something unexpected or, or uh, difficult that you still think about. Maybe it really hurt you, Gemini. Tell me about the person that Gemini is dealing with. What are their energies at this time? towards Gemini. Oh, it's way too many. What are their energies at this time towards Gemini? Wedding bells. Huh. Strong bonds, family. This person could have be married with a family, Gemini, or this is what they want with you. But I have a feeling that this is that family issues card. Bottom of the deck, I have moving forward. You're moving forward into a new chapter. So I feel like this person's probably um, getting out of some sort of family situation. We'll see. Messages for Gemini, please. Let's start with you, Gemini. Tell me how Gemini is thinking or feeling in this connection, spirit. Five of Cups. I feel like you have a lot of regrets, Gemini, or you really miss this person. Um, 
you think of the past a lot, maybe you want to talk to them with the Ace of Swords and then have the Hermit again. Some of you, I feel like, are probably thinking about how to fix this, how to communicate with this person, what to say. Maybe there hasn't been a lot of communication with this person, with the Hermit. Maybe one of you withdrew. But I feel like you have something that you want to tell this person. What's this Ace of Swords about? Why is Ace of Swords here? Death, Scorpio energy. You want to talk about what happened, how things ended. Perhaps you want to change or a transformation. Tell me about the Ace of Swords. Could be dealing with a Scorpio, a Virgo. Have water here as well. Yeah, King of Swords, Gemini, you want to talk to this person and you don't just want to talk to them, you want to talk about what happened. Tell me about the person that Gemini is dealing with. What are their thoughts or feelings at this time? What are they thinking or feeling at this time? See, Eight of Cups, again. I have an Eight of Cups here. This is someone that is thinking about leaving a situation, walking away from a situation. Then I have a King of Wands, yes, reversed. Tell me about this person that Gemini is dealing with. What are their thoughts or feelings at this time, Spirit? The world, yeah, this is someone that wants a whole new cycle. They want a whole new cycle with you, Gemini. And they're walking away from something to do it. Again, this has been a message that I keep getting. Back at the bottom of the deck, I have the Judgment card. A card about second chances. So why is the King of Wands reverse? Why is the King of Wands reverse? Why is the King of Wands reverse? Two of Swords reverse. The lovers reverse, tower reverse. So I feel like this person, if they're leaving a situation, they don't want to cause complete destruction. It's a very difficult choice that they have to make. I feel like they don't want to make a mistake. They don't want to jump into anything. They don't want this to blow up in their face. They have to be careful about the choice they make here. Yeah, tour, um, Higher font reverse. I feel like this person's getting out of a marriage or there is a commitment that's not doing well and it's on your person's side. Now, Gemini, if you're watching this and you're asking if this could be reversed, yes, the energies can be reversed or flipped. Flip them if they resonate for you. Tell me about the world. Why is the world here? Yeah, they want to come back out of the cold. Come back in out of the cold, have some sort of recovery. Again with the Ace of Wands reverse, Five of Swords reverse, Page of Pentacles reverse, Seven of Swords, Nine of Cups. Hmm. So I feel like they're not making any moves right now about this new beginning. I feel like they're trying to be strategic. Knight of Swords and the Sun. So this is someone that they want to talk first. They want to talk first. They want to be strategic. They want to do this smart because I feel like they would have a lot to lose. Very interesting. So what's the potential outcome? I'm going to pick a few cards here for the potential outcome. All right, for Gemini, let's see. What is the potential outcome here for the near future spirit? For Gemini, potential outcome, please, for the near future. Wow, we have the Wheel of Fortune. 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 <laughs> potential outcome for Gemini and this person. Huge changes down the line here. Fate and fortune on your side. Things moving forward cycles divine timing that's the wheel seven of pentacles 
investment time energy someone wants to know if this is something they can invest in four of swords so in the near future here i feel like there's probably going to be i don't know it's, it's almost like someone's waiting for the right opportunity patiently waiting for a, the right opportunity here someone's dreaming about action look at this in this card the four of swords this soldier is dreaming about movement and action here success also so i'm getting the sense that someone here could be dreaming about you or really thinking deep that hermit card came out twice about how they're going to take certain action and again with the seven of pentacles i'm getting someone that is really thinking strategically about how to best grow this how to best make this happen um but this wheel i feel is the most important here this is very strong energy and i cannot wait to clarify this and see what's coming with that um but that is a great sign gemini that things are probably going to start moving quickly once someone figures out what they want to do i think they're going to come in hot with like with this knight of swords here they're going to come in hot and talk to you and really um get this moving because you know they think you're like the bee's knees here with the sun uh, you make them very happy there's clarity about what they want to move towards it's just you know there are obstacles for your person um, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe and leave me a comment if it resonated for you, Gemini. Thank you so much to everyone who has already done that, who continues to support the channel and watch the readings. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. And I will see you all in another video. Take care.